Emerson, do we English good? What do you want somewhere? What they want somewhere? So. Leave the area? Yes. Wow, I love exploring as Makoto Nyeg. How do you want? One egg, one. I don't know. It's sound like Discord. It was Logan. Yasuhiro, how's it going, my dude? Could it be? Nothing's changed on this floor. Mm. The only difference is the gate blocking the stairs leading up to the third floor, or, or is gone. That that's important. Uh -huh. I guess that's where they want us to head uh, next. I wonder what kind of crazy stuff is up there. Aliens! Wait, no, Pablo! Pablo's there! Pablo! Jose... 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 Jose might be up here, because if they got aliens, they must have the third floor of Hope Speak Academy. I wonder what we're gonna find this time. What's up here? Drugs. How the fuck did I teleport this way? So, there's this room. The billiard room. Hmm. So this is a reconnection room, a place for students to relax, a relaxation room. I never would imagine a school having a place like this. <laughs> well, no normal school would have wood. It has a hello shangi. Even a dart board and pool table. Emerson, do you understand words? If so, please tell me what this person is saying in English. Because I don't understand what they're saying. They aren't here. I'm sad. And look at this. They have even provided us with a remarkable number of... Remarkable number of magazines. Isn't it wonderful? Those will certainly be helpful in keeping.
keeping our boredom at bay. Listen up! Ring, ring, ring! Hello there! Oh. Allow me to expand. Monokuma, why are you here? We've got fashion, fashion motorcycles, martial arts, video games, baseball, science, all kinds of magazines. Do you have video games? Oh, but nothing dirty. This is a school after all. Oh, if I need a quick... Oh, no. <laughs> Not reading that. So then... And will you be adding to our collection as new issues come out? Too bad! Sorry, no can do. Even if I wanted to, to. Well, now magazines are kind of, kind of what? Watch out! Oops. Nothing. Never mind. No, no, no. Anyway, that's it for my explanation. Bye, bye. <laughs> what? He just said. I know. Well, it bothers me too. Most unfortunate. Life here would be that much nicer if he could add some new issues once in a while. How disappointing. Welcome back. Thank you. Do you want me to read you a line that this character named Monokuma said? Oh? The character named Monokuma, I did a voice for him and you wanna know what line he just, but he said. What? Oops, nothing, never mind, no, 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 no. Anyway, that's it for my explanation. Bye bye. <laughs> like, that's the first. Oh my God. Like, that's what he said. R really? <laughs> Even Makoto was shocked with what he said. Well, damn. There's a dartboard. Ooh, slot machine. Nah, that's underage gambling. Ah, uh, hello there, Kyoko. Killed anyone lately? It would seem... So the third floor opened up this time. After a brief investigation, it looks like there is a physics lab and an art room. <sighs> I also found a huge machine of some kind in the physics lab. I wonder what it does. Kills people. <laughs> Ooh, a hallway. Ooh, another hallway. <gasps> physics. Yes, I need a. Fi I need. I like physics somewhat. This is the physics huh? lab. It's less like a classroom and more like some kind of research institution. Emerson, you're uh, smart. Is this a research institution? Uh, I don't know. Damn it. So we got, so if I look this way, we got Taka. Kyotaka Ishimaru. Taka, don't you think this place is like some kind of research institution? Still no reaction. No, no, shit, he ain't gonna react a lot. He just watched his best friend die. Oh, a room! Up. Uh, this is the equipment room. It's super disorganized and there's strange chemical smell in the air. Then get out of it! Like, Emerson, don't you agree? Huh? I said, don't you agree? If there's a strange chemical smell in the air, you should most likely leave that area. Hey, Emerson. Hmm? Look at my stream. Uh, 
funny thing is, Emerson. What? In Japan, Genocide Jill is known as Genocider Show. Huh. You wanna know uh, I called them on accident multiple times? Oh god. Gender Cider. Bruh. <laughs> Yo, what's your name? Gender Cider. Huh? What the fuck? I don't even know how I'm into meanness. Ah, uh, this place is so relaxing, so calming. The smell of formulaid hydra. I, I, I don't know how to read this. Do you? Emerson, what's the word after smell of? Um, just. Can I eat this? Formaldehyde? Thank you. It's the most unbearable. I'm getting seriously excited! Yeah, I'm not gonna do what she said. Oh, I just wanna drink my Donald. Donald. <laughs> oh, no. Myself, right? <laughs> oh, of course, genocide <laughs> Jack. That genocide Jill. She said to call him genocide. Can I eat this? Hi. It's shiny. Okay, you know what? You might. You might have to change the stream title to Three Idiots for no English because the, the game itself just messed up. Oh, okay. I thought you meant your friend was gonna join. Oh, wait, there's, a, there's an SD uh, card in this. Why is there an SD card in this? I should stop trying to eat random things. Emerson, should I stop trying to eat random stuff? What? Whoa! Okay. I didn't make it. So, three idiots. Change it to three idiots who don't know English. Emerson. M. Do you hear me? Because the game itself can't be the English. Okay. What? I was asking you, change it to three idiots? Okay. Of course, gender, genocide, gender side Jack. What joke? <laughs> genocide Jack likes it. That just goes to show how disgusting it really is. Hey, Genocide, how are you? A serial killer. Oh, yeah, no, the mood doesn't have anything. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I mean, is she fine? The black, pretty sure she's a serial killer. Damn. What is this thing? What? Oh, she's obviously. 
Ah, uh, well, no shit, Sherlock. No shit. What's up with this ridiculously big machine? Watch out! It's me, Monokuma. Watch out! Just fucking snaps me in the face. What? What, what you wanna do? Some quantum leaping? Ooh! Emerson, what is quantum leaping? I don't know. Damn it! Does your friend know? Probably not. Damn it. Huh. Uh, let me ask one of them, actually. Okay. I have one that might know. Okay. That's a time machine. Pretty awesome, all right? Yes. It was designed by a student, by a student here at Hope Speak Academy. The ultimate physicist. Although they don't go here anymore. They died during the tragedy. Hey. Oh. Time machine? Seriously, so it can go back in time? Okay, then let me go get in there. If I can go back to the past, then I can. <laughs> this time I'll stop Mondo for sure. <laughs> oh, sorry. Not possible. This particular machine, time machine, can only go back one minute. It comes in handy when you like. Leave your pizza, bagels, in the microwave if one minute too long. Bruh, that's all it's for? Yeah. One minute. I was sick. Hmm. You sound disappointed. Hmm. But actually, I was lying about the whole thing in any way. There's no such thing as a time machine. What? Hey! Um... Honestly, it's just an air purifier. Air purifier. In other words, it can produce clean air no matter where it you're at. With that thing, you could even live on Mars. Is this where Elon Musk got his plan from? Yeah. Is this where Elon Musk came up with the plan to go to Mars? But what with the disc abomination, gravity, and deadly low temperatures, you probably don't want to live on Mars. Emerson. What? Apparently you will die on Mars. Do you want to go to Mars? No. Damn it. Can I go to Mars? Hey, Emerson. Hmm. So, you agreed that the next time you come over here, you want to watch that movie I told you about that's on Netflix. <laughs> Should I give you a warning of the movie, about the movie real quick? Uh, sure. It has blood. Great. Fantastic. So, are you sure you want to watch it? Yes. Okay. My mom will most so likely. Are you going to I... Or have you found out if your mom is going to let you for the park? I'll ask my mom. I, okay. I literally went to step out of my bed. Well, off my bed, and I fucking step on a box. Good job. Box, man.
I have returned. Okay. And you want to know what my mom said? Maybe on yeah. Sunday because today is meant to be like a hundred and something. And Bruh. so is tomorrow. Yeah. No, I can check my phone to see how hot it's gonna get. So it's currently 95 degrees. And if my phone will open. The hardest it's gonna get is 102. Huh. That's not uh, awesome. Yep. Tomorrow, the hardest it will get is 100. Yeah. And also, you wanna know the funny thing is, Emerson? Hmm. The exact time, you, well, the time you said was either 3.30 or 4. 3 p.m. Mm -hmm. and 4 p.m. are both in the hundreds. Bruh. And pretty much my yeah, mom. Yeah, it's currently already 100. Lovely. Oh. Well, my mom told me that we leave on Wednesday. So. Yeah. And also, for some reason, my mom. I'm like. Uh, when my grandma said, oh, well, they could just come over to watch a movie. The first thing my mom said was, it's not a guy. That... Even if it was a guy, mom, you still would say no. <laughs> like, you let my sister have, like, 15 people over. No matter what gender they were. And then when it comes down to me, I can't even have one person not... Like, I'm, I'd be impressed if you let Hunter come over to spend the night. And he's my cousin! Uh, uh. So, and also apparently on Sunday, my mom wants to go take a car show thing. Uh. But also, you don't fucking say it's gonna be Friday when you change up the date. Like, you don't go, oh, Friday! Next year! Like, the fuck you mean, that Friday? Like, that's one of the main things I hate about you know, when being at my mom's a lot. You know what that is? My mom would say, one day, one exact time, and when, I, when it's that exact time and day, and I'm like, so are we gonna go? My mom's like, what? No, I meant that. I meant next week. You said what? today. Yeah, but I meant next week. And then the next week comes, and then I ask her again, and she's like, Oh, no, I meant next week. Which week, lady? Yeah, that's how I, I feel. Know. Because I'm like, okay, then which week after that? Next week's next week's next week. So you're pretty much saying in five years, yes. Like, you can tell why I don't... Why I like being at my dad more than my mom's. Because when my dad tells me in a day and time, I'm like, okay, and I know he's gonna live up to that. When my mom tells me, I don't mean know if she means this year or next year. That's why I'm just like, date, time, place, give. Yeah. I got my dad. Yeah, if he gives me a date and time, like a day, I'm like, okay, what time? He's like, whenever you want to go on that day. Yeah. And for my mom, she's like, okay, give me an exact day, time, and everything, okay? And I do, and then she's like, I'm mm, sorry, I can't do that. Why? I'm gonna have a headache on that day. Yeah. You can, you can just tell. Like, you can fucking tell when you have a headache. I'm sorry, you can just tell. Emerson, I took something apart. 
So I got motherboard. together Good job. hey check if it goes apart easily kind of so That's you guys you know what this seems like an actually good moment to pause me mad that my mom said oh we'll see because we want because we're going to that car we might be going to that car thing today by today I mean next year you can tell why I like how why I stay at my dad's more often than my mom's. <laughs> 